Good morning, everybody. It is so good to be here with you and see you guys again for another education class. I was going to introduce myself for those that are new. I am Dr. Laura Ritchie. I am a doctor of physical therapy, a national board certified health and wellness coach specializing in functional nutrition, women's health, insulin resistance, and I'm an essential oil educator and leader with doTERRA International. I want to thank you guys so much for being here for our green cleaning class. We're dual streaming on Facebook and Instagram, so I want to make sure that but you guys can hear me okay. Seems like you can, so, so far so good. We are so excited that you are here, and if you're watching the replay, welcome to the replay. I have a giveaway for one US viewer watching live, so stay tuned for all the details on how to snag that and win. This is gonna be an interactive workshop, so I really want to encourage you guys to create the time and space to really dive into this, grab something to drink, grab a pen and paper, turn off your notifications, go to a quiet place, and we are gonna jump right in and get started with all this information. Hey, Beth from Arizona. I love that you guys are popping on. Let me know where you're from. And this is going to be a blast. We are going to be talking about ditching those nasty toxins and things that are in our cleaners and why this is so important. It's interesting. I was listening to the chronic Lyme disease summit. If you guys caught that, it was really good. And I was also listening to a guest lecture last night in our nutritional endocrinology practitioner program. And there was this theme of reducing the toxins, reducing the chemicals that they're obesogenetic. They can cause us to gain weight and have lots of issues there. So I'm excited to dive into this with you guys deeper. If you're watching on Instagram, you can hop over to Facebook and actually see the slides. I've uploaded the slides for you if you want to download them or you're welcome to watch here and just hear the information that way too. Either way, but we are going to dive in. Oh, my Aunt Cindy's here. Hi, Aunt Cindy from New Mexico. This is exciting. Hope you're feeling better. So green cleaning, you know, this becomes important because our lives are very abundant. We tend to go towards what is the easiest thing that's going to work for us. There's a lot of products that promise to work, you know, be effective. And we're wondering, okay, is that quick fix really working for us? Is that going to be what's ideal for our health and wellness with everything? And again, quickly before we begin, I always like to start with a medical disclaimer that this information, it's not intended to replace a one-on-one -on -one relationship with your qualified healthcare provider. It's not intended as medical advice. Really, I'm just sharing my own knowledge, information from my research, education, and training. And I really encourage you to make your own decisions too based upon your research and in partnership with your qualified healthcare professional. That being said, let's dive in even more. Unlike food, cleaning products because of proprietary law, aren't required to list ingredients. And that makes it harder for us to know what is going to be a good choice for our home, for our health, for our kids, all of that. So it's a little, little concerning. And most conventional cleaning products are virtual chemical cocktails. They are full of all kinds of stuff, but they work. So we keep using them, right? To fight bacteria and to clean and scent our home and our laundry. Well, what's the issue with that? What's the concern? If you really want to green up your routine, you don't have to sacrifice cleanliness or even a pleasant scent. There are some natural solutions that are really cost effective. They're going to be very, very effective, and they're actually going to keep your family healthier, which is the goal for all of us, health is wealth. So we are gonna be talking about some of the worst toxic offenders that are commonly found in your household cleaning products and offer ways, simple swaps for healthier, safer options for your family and your home with this. So let's talk about phthalates. These are actually uh, plasticizers is, is what they are. They're found in products containing synthetic fragrances, such as air fresheners, dish soap, even toilet paper, guys, believe it or not. Companies don't disclose what is in their scent, so you won't really find this ingredient on the label, which is a little concerning. However, if you see the word fragrance, there's a good chance that the phthalates are present in that. They are known endocrine disruptors. Men with a higher phthalate compounds in their blood actually had correspondingly reduced sperm counts. So it's affecting fertility. This was from a 2003 study that was conducted by researchers from the Center of Disease Control and Prevention and the Harvard School of Public Health. That's a little concerning. Although exposure to phthalates mainly occurs through inhalation and breathing that in, it can also happen through skin contact, going in transdermally through the skin there, which is a synthetic which is a significant 
problem. Skin, unlike the digestive system, it doesn't have any real safeguards. Our skin isn't a raincoat. What we put on topically is actually being absorbed in there. So we wanna be aware of this. And again, it's a plasticizer. These are things that can actually cause us to gain weight. They're obesogenic, which is a concern. So when you're seeing those like little fragrance balls or stuff like in the laundry detergent, it's actually putting a chemical coating over everything and then that is on our skin all the time it's on our bed sheets and it's being absorbed so that is something to really concern ourselves about especially with fertility with our health with our hormonal health it's something that we need to get rid of for sure so an alternative for that for the air fresheners and things like that is just to diffuse essential oils and this is gonna be really beneficial when we can choose a fragrance-free option or an all-natural product with that. Bypass the aerosols or the plug-in fresheners. We, we don't need those in our life, guys. And instead, we wanna use essential oils, open a window, add plants to your home. That's a great way to reduce your toxic load. And while essential oils have a pleasant smell, they actually have health benefits that can be considered and is really important. So there are essential oils that can be used to purify our home. Many are lemon. Lemon's a great, very citrus uplifting purifying oil. Melaleuca or tea tree oil is very purifying and cleansing for us as well. And then there are specific blends like doTERRA's Purify or On Guard that contain these aromatic compounds and cleansing properties as well that smell really awesome. Hey, Hey, Pevy. Hey, Gabby. Hey, Lacey. It's fun to see you guys popping on. And essential oils can help open up your airways too. So something like doTERRA's breathe oil or lavender or eucalyptus can really help too to support your airways. And then there are oils like Arbor Vitae, Breathe, On Guard, and they can also help to minimize the effects of seasonal threats, which is good. So maybe in the winter time when people are feeling under the weather, or now it's springtime, if you have issues with pollen or nature, you can use the essential oils to support you. And only a few drops is needed when using your diffuser, so a little goes a long ways. It's very cost effective, and it's a much, much better solution to the harmful aerosol products. So you're getting cleansing and purifying properties, it's supporting your respiratory system it's supporting you emotionally way way better than those nasty chemicals and the the plugins and things so you guys can see here I actually have my little diffuser going it stays with me in my office to just cleanse and purify the air while I work works very very nicely and you just need a few drops you know anywhere from three to five drops to start out with is good little goes a long ways with this so diffusing is awesome if you're not doing that that's a great place to start to cleanse your air that was another theme in the lime summit they were talking about clean air clean food clean water all of that's really really important to support us and our detoxification pathways so another one to talk about is perchloroethylene or perk for short. So this is found in products such as dry cleaning solutions, spot removers, carpet and upholstery cleaners. Actually, according to the chief scientist of environmental protection for the New York Attorney General's office, PERC is a neurotoxin. In addition, the EPA classifies this PERC as a quote unquote possible carcinogen. So that's a cancer causing agent right there. With my history of a sarcoma, I might Ears perk up a little bit when I hear stuff like that. People who live in residential buildings where dry cleaners are located have actually reported dizziness, loss of coordination, and other symptoms associated with that. And while the EPA has ordered a phase out of perk machines in residential buildings by 2020, California is going even further and they plan to eliminate all use of perks by 2023 because of its suspected health risks. So these are things that we want to be aware of because again, when we're talking about neurotoxin that's affecting the brain and possible carcinogen, that's a cancer causing agent. So we definitely want to be on the lookout for those things. And I don't want to come to this from a place of fear guys, but more from an empowered place of knowledge is power. And when we know better, we can do better and we can make informed decisions for our health with this. 
So swap for you, carpet cleaner. You can actually just use a teaspoon of liquid castile soap. I love the Dr. Bronner's. You can find this at Natural Grocers, on Amazon, lots of places. And then a fourth of a cup of just good old white vinegar. You don't have to spend a lot. Got this one from Target or Walmart. You can get it in the big gallon jugs and a little goes a long ways. And then just two cups of water and three drops of an essential oil. So something like lemon or Purify, Melaleuca, any of those are really great on guard. And you just combine that in a spray bottle, spray those areas, spray that on the stain, blot with just a clean, damp cloth, cloth and you are good to go because you know commercial carpet cleaning solutions they do have those harmful chemicals and it's true that they're effective at getting that dirt and grime out but we want to look at non-toxic ways to clean our carpets and maintenance becomes really important with that so homemade carpet cleaners are more gentle so you don't need to keep on top of the spills and the stains and, and things as much. They're very safe. Um, you can have it out and ready to go. You know, carpet is where our children are crawling. They're putting their mouth on a lot of stuff, especially little babies. So just doing a non-toxic recipe is gonna be a really, really nice way to stay on top of those spills and stains and general carpet cleaner that you have in your in your home. I really like Melaleuca for this, but you, you could do whatever you like. It's a choose your own adventure. So you could do lemon or lavender, all of those are going to be great, great ones to use as well. And that's another topic, right? Isn't it concerning that we have to child protect and lock up our cabinets and things to keep our children from getting into them because it's toxic and harmful if they were to drink that or swallow that. And then we have to call poison control and all of these things. That's alarming to me. I'm going to be an aunt next month. I have a little nephew coming and I'm very excited about that. And it really starts to get you thinking about the things that we're using in our home, the cleaning products, all of that stuff, what we're putting on our skin. So this is a really great place to start. And again, it's, it's super, super simple. It costs pennies to make this stuff and it's going to last you a really, really long time. Triclosan. Okay, this is another big one that we need to talk about. It's found in most liquid dishwashing detergents. That's interesting because we're putting our food on that, right? And eating some of that stuff if it's on our plates. And it's also in hand soaps that are labeled antibacterial. So if you see that word, perk your ears up. That means triclosan is probably in there as well. It's a really aggressive antibacterial agent that can promote the growth of drug resistant bacteria not good. So the American Medical Association, the AMA, has found no evidence that these antimicrobials make us healthier or safer. And they're particularly concerned about overuse of antibacterial chemicals. That's how microbes develop resistant. That's how we get all of these resistant superbugs. In addition, the EPA is currently investigating whether triclosan has negative effects on thyroid hormones. So there's a lot for us to consider with this. Hey, Robin, thanks for jumping on. Triclosan, we don't need it. We don't need it in our life. So what you can do instead is make your own liquid dish soap. You can do this with just liquid castile soap. Again, Dr. Bronner's is my favorite. And you can add in your favorite essential oils. I love lemon. I love wild orange. I like the citruses, lime, citrus bliss, things like that. But whatever one is your favorite, you can do that too. You just want to fill it with a clean bottle with your castile soap. You can add a little bit of fractionated coconut oil if you like to just help moisturize if you like it a little bit thinner. I make it actually in a foaming pump soap and so you can add some water and put it in a in a foaming pump bottle like this or our On Guard soap, foaming hand soap, if you want it already done for you, super, super easy. Very, very cost-effective too. A little goes a long ways with this. So again, avoid the antibacterial products with triclosan. If you're hooked on a hand sanitizer spray, do the On Guard hand sanitizing mist. That's a really great option. It doesn't have, um, it's not going to dry out your hands like the regular stuff. And then it's empowered with your on guard essential oil. So again, so that we're not making those super bugs with all those antibacterial things. It's, it's too much. Yes, Robin, it's so easy, effective, smells amazing, way, way simple, way safer for us as well. And there are alternatives to liquid dishwashing detergents and you can, 
make your own. We have the On Guard Cleaner Can Concentrate, which I'll talk a little bit about, which we use to clean our dishes. It works really, really awesome. And the nice thing is when you switch to these things, you're no longer having to hold your breath to clean. You're not having to wear all of these gloves and masks and stuff and, and do that. You know, think about all those chemicals in our home. It's way more freeing. So let's talk about another one. This is Quaternary Ammonium Compounds or quats for short. So quaternary ammonium compounds, they're actually found in fabric softener liquids and in your dryer sheets. So look out for this in your laundry room. Quats are skin irritant and one in and one 10 year study of contact dermatitis. So dermatitis like inflammation, redness of the skin found that quats was actually a leading cause of this. And it's they're also thinking that it's a leading cause for respiratory disorders as well, which is a little concerning too. So something that we can do instead is just make our own fabric softener. This is super simple. You guys have seen me share about this on social media, but you really don't need fabric softener or dryer sheets to soften our clothes or to get rid of static. That's a myth, guys. Let's put that to bed. Simple vinegar works just as well. It's a natural fabric softener of choice for many reasons. One, because it's non-toxic, but it also removes the soap residue in the rinse cycle, and it helps to prevent static clinging in the dryer. And this recipe that we're gonna talk about, you can use any oil again, choose your own adventure. But what I do is I actually just get my vinegar. So again, by yourself we have a bunch of these in our pantry and we use them for everything so i just pour in the vinegar in the little fabric softener area of your washing machine and then i just add a couple drops of essential oil some of my favorites lemon is a regular favorite melaleuca you could do peppermint you could do lavender if you're doing your linens or bed sheets because that's very calming too and helps with sleep anything like that we don't need the fabric softener and then instead of dryer sheets what i love to use are dryer balls so these really cute ones they're rainbow colored they're from share oils and all you do it's very simple you just take your dryer balls so they come in three and you just add a drop of your favorite essential oil to that and then just put it in the dryer so you have all those going. They actually will dry your clothes faster. They're not gonna leave those chemical residues on top of your clothes. I promise your clothes are not gonna smell like vinegar either. I get that question a lot. It's a great way to upcycle and reduce the toxins in your laundry room. Works amazingly well. So let's talk about another one. This is 2-butoxyethanol. And this is found in window, kitchen, and multi-purpose cleaners. So you can find it in a lot of different, in different cleaners. It's a key ingredient in many of those window cleaners and it gives them their characteristic sweet smell. It belongs in a category of glycol ethers and it's a set of powerful solvents. So the law does not require this to be listed on a product label which is interesting. According to the EPA's website, in addition to causing sore throat when inhaled at high levels, these glycol ethers can also contribute to narcosis, pulmonary edema, so swelling in the lungs, and severe liver and kidney damage. That's a little concerning, right? Although the EPA sets a standard on this for workplace safety, if you're cleaning at home in a really confined area, like say an unventilated bathroom, you can actually end up getting this in the air at levels that are higher than workplace safety standards. That's a little concerning too. Oh, Bebby says her dog loves to steal the dryer balls. <laughs> so if you need a little toy for your dog too, they can do that. And the nice thing is they're just little drops of lemon in there so that is safe if your kids like to play with them or something like that your dogs you don't have to worry which is nice right like unlike the chemicals and things that have safety locks and we lock them up and all that kind of stuff so here's an all-purpose cleaner recipe for you very very simple you're just going to do a cup of white vinegar a cup of water and then 10 drops of whatever oil you like that could be lemon lemon's one of my favorite oils that we always kind of have on hand for stuff and you just combine this in a spray bottle again 
and just spray on your glass, wipe clean with a lint-free cloth. Works very, very nicely to get rid of those things. You know, just besides the many benefits to the body, lemon, it's a powerful cleansing agent. So when you mix this up and you're using this as your all-purpose cleaner, this can help you shine stainless steel. It can remove grime from your microwaves. You can clean your mirrors, your windows, and freshen your garbage disposal. You can do a lot with this cleaner and with lemon. Lemon's a really awesome oil. Sodium hydroxide, here's another one that we should talk about. So this is actually found in oven cleaners and drain openers, otherwise known as Lyle. Sodium hydroxide is extremely corrosive. It can actually cause severe burns when used inappropriately. Research confirms that Easy Off Oven Cleaner and Mr. Muscle Oven and Grill Cleaner for example, they contain poisons that can cause difficulty breathing due to fumes as well as swelling in the throat. So again, things that are a little bit concerning that we wanna look into there. So instead we can make our own oven cleaner. And this is very simple. You can clean the grimiest ovens with this baking soda paste that we're gonna make. It, it just takes a little bit more elbow grease. However, the benefits outweigh that extra work. You're not having those issues with your respiratory system or other, other things that can pop up with that. So you can do two tablespoons of a cast style soap, one and a half cups of baking soda, a fourth of a cup of vinegar, and then eight drops of wild orange essential oil and water. And you'll see those citruses come up a lot. They're really great at busting out the grease. And these are just simple ingredients that you probably already have in your home with most of these, right? Baking soda, vinegar, things like that, that work really nicely. So green cleaning products, they're gonna improve our air quality indoors, which is really important. They're gonna lower the health risks brought to us by traditional cleaning products that we have. It's been proven that green products for cleaning can reduce health issues such as eye, respiratory, skin burns, irritations, allergies, headaches, chemical poisoning, nausea, even reproductive hazards. So if you're concerned with money saving, then green products are gonna be the best answer for you. Compared to other cleaning products, these are really going to cost less. They're going to save you money. Many of you could be asking, okay, why should I start buying green products? Well having these natural products in your home is going to replace and get rid of the chemicals that could endanger the health of you and your family. Again, we've got kiddos that are, you know, crawling on the carpet, inhaling these things. These things are being absorbed into the skin. It's really, really important. Your health is your wealth. And not only are these a cheaper, safer option, they're very effective as well. So I would really encourage you. I think so many people feel like overwhelmed by making their own cleaning products, but it's really simple. It's really fast. They will last you a long time. And once you switch over, you're done. Like once you toss out all of those other things, it's like, okay, we're good to go. You know, other things like staying hydrated, drinking lots of water, eating a clean diet. Those are daily habits and lifestyle changes that we do. But when you make those swaps with your cleaners, it's really easy and very, very simple. So here is one of my favorite resources for you. This is the Environmental Working Group's Guide to Healthy Cleaning. Definitely check out their website. They have lots of really good information there and you can actually search and type in your cleaners or different things that you're using and see what health grade it's giving it. So this is a very empowering resource. They also have an app, the Environmental Working Group's Healthy Cleaning app too. And, and what's cool is you can take it with you in the store if you've got the app on your phone and you can just scan stuff as you're picking it up. They have it for skin and cosmetics too, the skin deep. So the environmental working group is a really, really great resource that I highly encourage you guys to take advantage of. Very, very empowering to have that information at hand. And then another thing, if you're needing ideas of where to get supplies, I really love shareoils.com. Elka, the owner, she's a dear sweet friend of mine. And that's actually where I got my spray bottle from, where I got the cute labels from. She's got just about everything there. So if you're needing to stock up, my preference is glass. You don't have to use glass, but I like the glass bottles. You can get the little labels everything there. She's also got the adorable dryer balls as well. And she has gifted us with a coupon code. Yes, girl 15. 
all lowercase, all together for 15% off your entire order through May 15th. So if you want to start making simple swaps, and maybe that's, you know, just doing some dryer balls or just adding in a little bit of essential oil and white vinegar instead of your fabric softener. Maybe you just start with one area at a time. This can make a huge impact on your overall health and wellness. And I love that she's gifted us with this coupon code for a couple more days. So check that out if you need to stock up on tools and resources and save even more that way. I briefly mentioned the On Guard Cleaner Concentrate earlier. This is actually 10% off this month, which is really great. Again, it's a concentrate, so a little goes a long way. This bottle is going to last you a very, very, very long time. All the instructions on how to use it are right on the bottle. So if you want something, a quick fix, a quick button, an easy button, this would be it. It works as a multi-purpose cleaner when you just mix just two tablespoons of this with 24 ounces of water. That's it. So if you really wanted to, you could put two tablespoons of this in your little glass spray bottle and do that. That's it. Done and done. Very simple. For laundry, you can actually use a tablespoon of this with your detergent and that just helps to eliminate odors and microbes. Anything that you have there works very nicely in the bathroom as well. So you just mix three tablespoons of the concentrate per 24 ounces of water in the bathroom. I love this. I love this for cleaning toilets, countertops. You don't have to hold your breath. And for dishes too, it works really nicely. So you just mix three tablespoons of concentrate per gallon of water. So if you've got really, really tough jobs, right, you can just put this straight on to the area, let it soak. Again, it's very, very concentrated. Um, you're not gonna wanna do direct use of this on hardwood floors or natural stone. You're gonna wanna dilute. So again, do like a tablespoon and use that. Yes, you can clean your veggies too. That's a great bliss cooking. That's a great option. So yeah, you can put a little bit of this and clean your veggies. I will often do that with a little bit of lemon or a little bit of honor clean on guard cleaner concentrate or actually your on guard foaming hand soap. You can use that to clean your produce too and wash your produce guys. You're not the only ones who've been touching that. Like I, I guarantee you other people have handled that. So wash your produce. That's a great, great option. Great question too to have on hand and a little goes a long way. So with one of these bottles, if you're doing two tablespoons per 24 ounce spray bottle, this is actually going to make you 12 bottles and it's gonna be a dollar and 20 cents each, actually less than that because it's 10% off this month now. So a little goes a long ways with you. This is gonna last a really, really long time. I, I like to stock up because it was on sale this month. It's a great, great option. So we talked and really focused on green cleaning. If you're really looking to up-level your health and wellness to support yourself with natural remedies, there's actually the top 10 essential oils that we use and several of them can be used in cleaning too for several different things. So we've got oregano, that's a really powerful antioxidant. It's great to take when you're feeling under the weather. You can cook with this, just one drop will go a long ways, but it's really, really great for immune support and as well as maluca. So we mentioned maluca in a lot of these recipes too. That's tea tree oil. We call it the zit zapper. If you've got a blemish on your skin, you can put that right on it. It's great for skin care. It's great for nail care. It's also really powerful for your immune system as well. We've got on guard. That's our protective blend. It smells like Christmas. It's very, very great to help cleanse, to help disinfect, to boost your immune system. And again, some things we, if we can't take them or put them on our skin or take them internally, it makes you a little bit nervous about cleaning with them, right? Or what we're putting in our personal care products. So that's a great one. Same thing with frankincense. It's very great for immune support. It's very great for cleansing. It's great for disinfecting. It's great to support your mood. If you have anxious feelings or anything like that, it's really, really awesome. So Pebby says she found on guard foaming hand soap is great for oily stains. Oh, that's a nice tip. One thing I had to use the olive oil cake out the first time. Oh man. Oh, when you made an olive oil cake. <laughs> so there you go. If you're, if you have oily, oily stains, you can use your on guard foaming hand. So we love the on guard line. What I like about it is it's safe, it's effective, and then it's got the on guard oil in there. So you're boosting your immune system when you're using it too. And that's a great thing to do throughout the year, right? Not just during the winter time with that. Lemon, it's very detoxifying, as we mentioned, very cleansing. It's a great mood booster. Any of the citrus oils are really great for that. They're also really great for any type of, it's like a, a natural goo gone, if you will. So if you 
are, say your little ones took marker and drew on your table, <laughs> or they got gum in their hair, or you're trying to get a sticker off something, lemon works really, really nicely. If you have little ones in your life, you need lemon in your life. Oh, thank you, Bliss Cooking. Yes, it's, it's um, that was so sweet of you. Thank you. Yeah, all the, it starts with the diet and the lifestyle, and I feel like the oils are just so complimentary to that. I actually have lemon in my water right now to stay hydrated. So I hope you guys are all drinking your water. Let's take a drink. Stay hydrated throughout the day, right? It's very, very important. And then we have lavender. It's very calming. If you're feeling stressed, if you need support with sleep, if you have any type of skin issues, it's really great also for seasonal threats. So right now it's pollen time it's springtime if you're one of those people that has issues going out in nature and you don't want to stop and smell the roses because you feel like you need all the kleenex after that lemon lavender and peppermint that combo is amazing and the nice thing is it's safe to take internally doTERRA's oils are and you can do a drop or two of each and take that internally or diffuse that or dilute it with a carrier oil in a roller and apply that over the chest the bridge of the nose over the sinus area all of that is really really great yeah it is easy to forget that's it's always nice to get those reminders right with all of that stuff lavender is really great I love to use that when I'm washing my sheets so um, putting that on the dryer balls mixing that with the white vinegar because it is very calming and I love my sheets to have that scent of lavender on there peppermint it's very energizing it's really great for focus it's great for cooling the body we are going to take a little summer vacation trip in a little bit to Disney World. So I'm making a peppermint spray to just spray to the back of our neck or skin to be very cooling. That's great, especially with summertime coming up. It's nice. And it's really great for all things respiratory. It's great if you are a noisy sleeper or maybe your spouse is a noisy sleeper. Peppermint can help to support your respiratory system. Also great for digestive support. There's so many things there. And then um, same thing with breathe. Very great for respiratory support. Great for uh, seasonal threats, environmental threats, pollen, anything like that, noisy sleeper, <laughs> peppermint's actually in breathe and breathe just kind of takes it to that next level, but it's all things for respiratory support. Very, very great. And then we have Digestsen. Digestsen is the digestive blend. It's whole things for digestive support. If you are feeling a little green at the gills, if you get motion sickness when you travel or anything like that, um, I tend to have a hard time with anesthesia and I had a procedure last month and when I was waking up, I started feeling green to the gills and I had my digest sun oil and I just smelled it right out of the bottle. It made a huge difference. And then last but not least in our top 10 is deep blue. Deep blue is really great for muscle support, for joint support, for aches or discomfort, for massage. It's great if you work out. If I know that I'm doing legs, I'll put it on my legs before I work out and then after to help with any of that soreness that you may have after your workout. So if now is a good time for you, if you don't have a person that is helping you with essential oils, I would love to be that person to help and serve you. Right now, just for this month, if you get started with the Home Essentials Kit, which is all of those top 10 oils that we just went through, plus a petal diffuser that I have here that I keep on hand, which is really nice. So there is about 250 drops in each of these bottles of oil. So a little goes a long way with that. Again, because with our recipes, we're just using a drop or two, which is really, really helpful. So top 10 oils in those bottles, there's about 250 drops. It's gonna last you a really, really long time, plus a diffuser. And that's a really, really great bargain because frankincense, a large bottle of pure frankincense, unadulterated frankincense is $93 retail. Just the petal diffuser is around, I believe around 67, somewhere in there. So this is all bundled for 275. And then just this month, you actually get some goodies free. You get the Ungar toothpaste, which I love. This is a fluoride free toothpaste. If you are having issues with your thyroid, or maybe you're noticing some some issues with that, noticing some symptoms or things, um, you wanna avoid fluoride because fluoride actually competes for the iodine receptors and iodine is needed by the body for many, many different things, but especially to make thyroid hormone. So I would really encourage you to get a fluoride free toothpaste and this is naturally sweetened with xylitol and it's got your on guard. And people ask me all the time, how do you get your teeth so white? Do you whiten your teeth? No, I just use my on guard toothpaste. So it's really, really incredible. So that's included for free. 
The On Guard hand sanitizer that we talked about, which is really awesome, is also free in that. Not one, but you'll get an extra bottle, a large bottle of On Guard essential oils. So you could have one for just for cleaning purposes or things like we talked about today. And then a full size bottle as well of Wild Orange. So this retail value, I think it's around $58 of a bunch of extra goodies that you get free just for this month. doTERRA only does a sale like this just a few times a year. So that's really cool. If you get started with the Home Essentials Kit, you will get all of those things extra goodies and things for free. And then I'm putting on a really fun Mother's Day flash sale Saturday and Sunday. So stay tuned for that. I'll do another video and kind of go into the details of these are all the goodies and awesome things that doTERRA provides. I'm throwing in some extra goodies and things as part of this flash sale too, to support you. So if it's, if it's Mother's Day, if you're looking to up upgrade your health and wellness and that of your family. I can't think of a better gift actually for your mom or for you for self-care for any of those things because from aches and discomfort to sleep to respiratory support to immune support to getting rid of the toxins and the chemicals, it's really, really incredible. We actually have a private Facebook team just for our oils family with continued education support. I teach a lot publicly because I want to help people. Not everybody has that support. But when you get started, we actually schedule people with a Zoom call. We go over your specific health and wellness goals, how the oils can help to support you, teach you how to dilute your oils safely for kids, teach you how to make roller bottles so that you feel really supported with that. Because a lot of people, maybe they feel overwhelmed, maybe they feel like they're not sure what to do. And those oils and things are not gonna serve you if they're sitting on a shelf. So we really come in to empower and encourage people. And we have access to all of our whole virtual library of classes that I've taught over the years. So if you don't have an oils person, please reach out to me. I would love to help and support you along your journey. It's a big deal when choosing a person to get started with. You're kind of married to them a little bit. It can be challenging to switch. So I really want to encourage you because there's a lot of people out there selling a product. There's not as many people out there providing that continued education and one-on-one -on -one support that we do. And it's, it's a love language of mine with my own health history and challenges that I've had. I'm really passionate about empowering people, educating people with natural resources and holistic health. So that's really important. Okay. Here's all of my contact information for you guys. This is my website, lauraritchie.vpweb.com. If you need a little bit more private support along your health and wellness journey, I do offer private virtual health coaching. If you'd like that individualized support, there's my email, womenshealthcoach at gmail.com. If you have any questions or you want to reach out for support, oh, Peppy says the peppermint spray is great for overheating. Never go Never go south without it. Haha, <laughs> that's a good tip. Yeah, peppermint is, is pretty awesome. Uh, my Facebook page is facebook.com backslash Dr. Laura Ritchie. So please go and like it. You'll be notified of any upcoming classes. I teach a public education class once a month for everybody. I am on Instagram, Periscope, and Pinterest at Dr. Laura Ritchie. You can find me on YouTube as well. And our education group that we do those classes on Facebook is Learning with Dr. Laura. So you can search there and we can add you in so you can see the slides. I'm actually gonna be uploading a, a free ebook on green cleaning with more recipes to that group. So if you wanna download that, have that as a resource, you'll wanna join the group for that. And then I'm also part of the Two Curls on Oil podcast. You can find us over on Facebook, facebook.com backslash Two Curls on Oil. Our May podcast is coming up soon, Tuesday night this Tuesday night at 7 p.m. Central Time on our Facebook page. And we are going to be talking about beyond the daily health habits challenge. So in doTERRA, we've been doing our daily health habits. And we're gonna be talking about how to create a 90 day plan for yourself, how to continue that because our health is our wealth and how to support you with specific individualized plans for different things. So that's gonna be really, really fun. Go over, like our page and you can click going on the event. So you get a reminder before we kick off on Tuesday night. And then let's get to the giveaway, right? Because that's really exciting. And I should say before we jump into the giveaway that everything that we're talking about in this class is specific to doTERRA essential oils. They are the most trusted, most researched, most pure essential oils that you can purchase on the planet. I did a lot of research before choosing a company to go with. You will see on doTERRA's oils a supplement fact right there that lets you know if it is safe for internal use. So please do not expect to get therapeutic grade results with oils that you buy at Walmart or the health food store. Those are synthetic fragrances. So similar to the phthalates, similar to the stuff that we're talking about, those are synthetic 
fragrance, not something that you would want to inhale, not something that you would want to take internally, not something that you would want to put on your skin. So be very, very careful. There is a big difference with that. The other difference is doTERRA has co-impact sourcing. So the oils come from the areas where they're indigenously sourced, where they're native. So for example, frankincense comes from Somalia, lemon comes from Italy, lavender comes from France. There's no other company in the world that is providing us with that. So very near and dear and true to my heart. So I just want to preface that because I have people go out, buy oils from Walmart or other places, and then notice that they don't work or they actually make them feel yuckier and quality matters. Just like we're talking about with all these chemicals and things. Very, very important. Oh, thank you, Michelle. She's saying she loves the tips for the fabric softener. Yeah. Oh, Pebby. Thanks so much. If you're new, Dr. Laura is amazing with her support and information. It's a great time to start. Thanks so much, Pebby. Yeah. So let's do our giveaway, right? So if you're on Instagram, you'll want to hop over to Facebook. So you can participate in our giveaway. This is for people that watch live as a thank you. So if you've hung on with me till the end, what we are giving away, this is actually a pretty cool bundle, is some really pretty, a couple things actually. So one is this from Share Oils. I love Share Oils. This is her safety for a safer, cleaner home, essential oils for cleaning. So this is her tear pad. It's got lots of amazing recipes and things in there. I love, again, I love Elka at Share Oils and we gave you that coupon code, the yes girl 15 But this is a really great resource if you wanna learn even more and dive deeper. I will be mailing this to you. For a US viewer, we've got a diffuser recipe book. So again, getting rid of the Lysol, aerosols, Glade plugins, things like that. This will give you lots of tips and tricks and tools for that as well. And then these here, these are pretty cool. So these are tidy dishcloths. This is 100% organic cotton towels. They're highly, highly absorbent and they have textured loops to really help with your cleaning. It's a great way to reduce the need for paper towels, to clean in your home, right? We're upgrading with all of these things, so they're very beautiful. They're kind of rainbow colored. I thought they were really pretty. So we have those as well, so you can get you cleaning. And then we also have an essential oil spray and roller recipes from Share Oils. And this is actually a really great book. So if you're feeling, if you're new to this, it's got tons of recipes tons of resources for everything from an all-purpose spray there's a facial toning mist there's produce cleaning spray just a little bit of everything in here from share oils it's a really really nice guide and book i have one as well that i use all the time so here's a little bundle of resources and education and some really cool organic cleaning towels for you to enter the giveaway all you have to do is over in the facebook group type in a comment something you learned something you found helpful anything at all pertaining to what we were talking about in this class and you will be entered into the giveaway and we'll choose a winner about 20 minutes after we end this class for us. We'll go on and I'll put out all the entries into a randomizer. So just post your learning comment below in the Facebook group. You'll be entered into the giveaway for one lucky US viewer. I hope it is you. This replay for this class, if you're watching on Instagram, it's only up for 24 hours. If you're over on our Facebook page, Learning with Dr. Laura, the replay is gonna be up until June 1st to watch. So you can make sure that you can take notes, watch it as many times as you want before it comes down. I wanna thank you guys all so much for being here. I it's a pleasure to share, to educate, to teach with you guys. If you start to implement some of these tips, maybe you make your own cleaning spray or use a dryer ball or make your own fabric softener, please take a picture and post and share on social media and tag me. I love to see how people are using these classes to help them and support their health and wellness journey. I will see you guys next month for another education, health and wellness class. I believe, I think I'm gonna be talking about in June, Let's talk about maybe tips for staying healthy in the summertime, summer health tips, something fun like that. And it's always a pleasure to be here. So thank you so much for joining us live or watching the replay. And I'm just so excited to be part of this community. You guys are awesome. Sending you each lots of love and light and support along your healing journey. And thank you guys so much for being here. Have a great rest of your day, guys. Bye.